And today I wanted to bring to you a huge mega Tuesday morning haul. Um, I went on a spending freeze for two months and then I went to Tuesday morning and this is what happens. Um, so the last time I did a mega haul like this, I looked back on my YouTube video, it was back in December. So at Christmas time. So I guess, I guess we're going to say it was uh, Christmas in July again for this year. Um, I went about a week ago and they had some really good stuff that they had not had um, previously. So I did stock up on these sticky thumbs. I like to use these um, for when I'm laying out my scrapbook page and then I go back and then I re-glue. But this stuff lets me move stuff around and then I go back with my scotch glue and, and glue it down and secure it. Um, I got five of those actually I needed. I just had run out so I had to open up a pack this weekend. I also got these um, tag presses and I also got the punch that went with it but I had put that away already but I was watching a video somebody had posted in one of the groups that I'm in that Tim Holtz uses his uh, Big Shot to press these down but I also got the punch as well just in case that didn't work so I got this and the punch and another package that came with a punch of a, a variety of sizes then they had a bunch of uh, brads which um, I like brads and I seen on a haul that they had them and that this is why I went um, specifically was to get the brads and then all this other stuff was just icing on the cake I guess but um, yeah, so they had Christmas brads. I don't know if you can see those. Uh, they had the green. They had these, uh, these are love and lemon um, with some sayings on them. I love the blue. I think they had them there in pink too as well, but my store did not have the pink ones. Um, the red, some more blue, some pink. These are little ornate different pictures on them and then uh, I guess these are flourishes is what I call oh, yeah flourishes and I like to put these on pages to show uh, movement or wind um, and they they add that just that extra special touch at the end so I do like to use these on my pages those they had uh, love and lemon again these bows I got I, uh, one of my kits I received jelly bows um, in my secret not secret kit they really worked well on the page they only had one pack left so I snatched those um, some pebbles square let's see mini ABC stickers um, which I like to use on my page for subtitles um, this over here. Then they had one, they only had one pack of these KNC assorted uh, super poses, posies. So those will look really good on uh, one of my daughter's younger pages. And then they had happy days. So they had all, they had the papers too, which I'll show in the paper stack. But so I've got the brads, I got the uh, journaling cards, and then I got the kit with some stickers in it as well. Some also enamel triangles. I love the bright colors. I might base a kit off of this actually. Some of the stuff I was gonna um, base kits off of, mini kits and bag up for myself and same thing with this mind's eye they didn't have the um, paper pack there but they did have the stickers and the enamel dots so I may create my own kit using that as a starter oh and they also had the journaling cards for the mind's eye splendors which I wish they had the paper because I really like this um, the colors and the floral then I got uh, just what I need, another stamp, right? But I thought this would be cool for the dates. Um, and I like the way that Good Vibes Only Adventure with the little tree. I thought that that was kind of cool. Um, and they have all the little um, stamps that go along with it. And then they had uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. They had Days of the Week. And they had the abbreviated version. It's uh, Kelly Creates. So um, I was going to use that more for my pages as well. 
Um, and then thickers. Well, these are the stickos. These are still $1.99, which is nice. I don't know if you can see there's like a sewn white dotted line around them. So I thought that was cool. I picked up three packs of those. And here are thickers. These are lemonade, and I love these. Um, and I'm hoarding them. I think I have another pack of these. But um, that's what I do with I love thickers. I Every time I go to Tuesday morning, I make sure that I stock up on my thickers. Uh, these are Journey, and I have another pack of these. This was the only pack they had for the Journey, and I have one in my Secret Not Secret Kit Club, so I'll be throwing those with that kit. Um, these, again, only one of these. These were Sweet Clementine. I wish they had more. I love the, the pink foil in between there. And then these are Marquee, which I got two packs of those. Um, the only problem with these types is you can't uh, Frankenstein them because they're all different colors. Um, you can't, and they're outlined in the white. Like sometimes I'll take and I'll cut this off and make these the, my B's E's, um, but I can't do that with it. I mean, if I got desperate, I guess I could. Um, and then I got three packs of these. Epiphany, Illumination, huh, anyways, uh, so I got three packs of these, and then these are like, I don't know if you can see, they kind of change color um, in the light, these are Harmony, only one pack of those, and I have a bunch of these, but I use them on a lot of my pages, this is Delight, Uh, these are black and they have uh, white uh, writing on them. They're Vicky. One more pack of those. And then we're back to the stickos, um, which I glue all my stuff down. So if they don't stick well, I'm okay with it because I'm going to go back and after I get them set, I glue them down. And these are color wash. Uh, these are pink paisley, which. They're like peach, which are awesome. Can't wait to use those. And these are Dear Lizzie, and they're, uh, and they're I don't, it's gold, and then they have the pink on the um, edges. So that's really cool. Then they had a bunch of chipboard. Um, this is Pick Me Up, and I have a lot of these collections, and a lot of these stuff, that these things, you can just use on many pages. So I did get two of these um, for $2.19. I thought it was a pretty good deal. So we have that. I think I have these backwards. This one is Horizon, which this one will go in my Secret Not Secret Kit Club, the Horizon kit. Um, and then once again, I mean, you can just use this stuff on, on so many different things. I thought these were cool. These are Hope hope and dream but they're blue glitter uh, and it's about scrapbooking share creating you know wake up friends paintbrush um, so I was happy about that and then this one is more uh, summer pool it's called splash 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 sea and sand which will probably work out really well with my secret not secret kit club what is that called uh, creative cuts then I got the Pink Paisley Outfitters. I him hawed around about this, but I did like, because I don't know, you know, I'm never going to use this guy here. Um, but then I looked over and they have the white sheet and the color ones. So I, I will definitely use these. Um, may just cut off the bottom, put that in the, on the free table. Uh, Pebbles, word stickers, pink, uh, pale pink, uh, mint, and then the bright pink which I always like to add those into my page. They're a nice finishing touch. Uh, 200 and stick, 206 stickers from Maggie Holmes. Um, I think I might have had these already, but you know, you can never have enough Maggie Holmes, right? So there's that. Uh, Wildflower, just gold, thick. It's, they're like thickers. They are thickers, uh, just different sentiments. I like the script on them. These are Puffy, and these is New Roads, and I think this is also part of the Horizon. If it's not, it's going to go in with the Horizons, because that's what it reminds me of, the Horizons collection. Um, love this. This is Heidi Swap, um, just the gold and the pale pink and the mustard yellow. 
um, and the wood uh, ampersand. I just I, I gravitate towards that. Then this is another one, Summer Lights. I him hot about. You know, it's kind of cutesy for me, but you know, I figure for a dollar ninety nine, I can use some of the stuff. Um, and who knows, I might end up using all of it. I say that sometimes, and then I find out I love it. Um, this one is Pebbles, just different summer uh, weekend kind of icons. So, oh, my daughter just bought Birkenstocks. Uh, let's see, what is this? Wild Child? Again, you know, some of the stuff I, I may not use, but there's enough on here for $1.99 that I will definitely, definitely use. Then they had the Whimsical. So, I guess they, I, they only have one of those. Um, love the round elements here. And the little banner, too. Can't wait to get into that. And then they had some... Just, uh, yeah, I bought two of these for uh, double spray lead layouts. They remind me of Christmas. So, that'll probably go in my Christmas stash. So, that is all of stickers and ephemera and stuff but then I went a little paper crazy so they had a six by six paper pads I got two of the wolf packs they're stuck together which I thought 95% of this collection is awesome um, I think the bears I would have a hard time using but I could always back my paper with that um, yeah and the wolves maybe but we did uh, stay at the Wolf Lodge, so maybe I could use it there at the zoo. Um, so I got both of those. And then the Everday, who's, I'm not sure who, oh, this is Jen Hatfield, and I believe I have the 12 by 12 pack of this as well. Um, not a fan of the pineapples, but you know, I can, like I said, I can back paper, back pictures with those, and you, you never know that they're pineapples. So love that. Then I got the Golden Rod by One Canute too which I love their stuff. Um, just flip through real quick. Like I said, that's the golden rod. And then I got the new, new day by Dear Lizzie, which that is cool for titles. But once again, I like the word, the, the cactuses, not a big fan, but like I said, I'll just back pictures with those. Oh, got that. And then a follow your heart record it. My mind's eye. I really like this one as well. Um, I may be putting this in a kit um, with the colors, the pale colors to use. So that's my six by six. Then we moved on to the larger ones. Uh, six by eight. They had the new flourish, which I am basing a kit off of this. Um, I think I think I'm basing it off of this paper right there. Um, and I, I started, so this is going to go in that kit. Turn the page. I really like this collection. Anytime I find anything by turn, for turn the page, I always purchase it. Because I always use it. That's an awesome collection. And then Heart and Home. Um, once again, I bought two of these, and I'm basing a huge collection off of this. Um, this is one of my favorites. And I believe, where's the paper that I'm basing it off of? Huh. It's this paper right here with the birds. That's strange. Oh, there it is. It's the brown, the green, and the uh, light blue. I got two of those. Um, this, I don't know if this was a deal, but it's a uh, two envelopes for your memorabilia, $3.99 Project Life. But every time, I see those there every now and then, and I pick up one when I see them for my memorabilia. And then, I'm getting close, getting close to the end. Like I said, this is super mega. So, they had the Project Life here. Uh, this is Confetti Edition, and the color spoke to me, the bright colors. I do like to scrap in the graphic colors. So I got that. And this one is Bloom Edition. Uh, 
with the purple, maroon, uh, orange. So I, I like to use my Project Life cards as I back my photos with them, and I like to use them for journaling. So got that. And then we got just some green basil paper. I purchased this. I purchased one of these uh, maybe three months ago, this Fastinista, three or four months ago. And I want to do some double page layouts. Um, I got some, some ideas for this, for uh, autumn idea. So I thought I would pick up another one just in case it wasn't there. Then we got the My Minds Happy Day, which is kind of quirky, unique. There's the sticker sheets. Um, I like the navy and the green in this, and that's what drew me to this collection. Um, it definitely was not the cactuses or the crazy birds, but you never know. You may find those on my page. And then we have a bunch of outdoors. We like to hike and uh, camp. Uh, my daughter was a Girl Scout for many years, and I have a bunch of camping photos. So I uh, got two of these for some two-pagers and the great outdoors. So here is the sticker sheet and then the different paper. I love that paper right there. Um, these may be good for uh, masculine layouts, too, with the wood grains and the blue and the orange. So, And... Uh-oh. Um, oh snap! I got. I bought when I bought that Fastinista one. I had bought this uh, Echo Park one, um, and I wanted to make sure I had both. I had two because there's only one page of each in. So if I do two page layouts, um, I will have the two pages. So I love this uh, cut apart sheet. I, I don't know if you can see it with, the, but I like the way they did that. Then I have. The 12 by 12s. I was so excited to find Vicki Putin. So this is, I'm not sure where her, her, the names of them are on it, but this is the, I'm not sure which one this one is. I think that's field notes, but I'm not hundred percent sure. And then here's the other one that I got. Um, very excited. I love her paper and yes, I am hoarding it. Um, through. And I have her stencils. Um, do a quick flip through this. This one is, I'm pretty sure this one's field notes. But I mean, it's gorgeous. Just, I love that. Um, just, and I have a few pieces of this paper in the Secret Not Secret Kit Club. And I will be making a super huge Vicky Booten um, kit to work with. Um, and then I'm going to have to stop hoarding it and start using it. Then I got the 12 by 12 Saturday afternoon. One canoe, two. Love the avocados. Don't know what I'm going to do with them, but I love the avocados. Well, ice cream cones, some text, cut aparts. And then I think, is there a repeat? Yeah. Yeah. So there's that. And then I also got the golden rod in the 12 by 12. I don't know. I'm out of frame. Sorry about that. Um, lemon slices. Just different. I mean, I just really like the navy. And I like one canoe, two canoe. This is beautiful. It's just gorgeous. But yeah, popsicles. Got a whole mixed bag of everything in this. It's awesome. Some strawberries. Okay, and then I got beach days. Uh, I am doing the summer 444 scrapping with um, Janet um, at RTS and she is using this as her kit and I created my kit out of something else. Oh, this paper is really thick and uh, I created it out of something else but I thought that this would be good to do a second round with because I do have many, many, many summer photos that I need to scrap. Um, let me move these over here. Okay, and this is the last of it. So, uh, big fan of wood grain. I love wood grain. Um, anytime I find wood grain, I purchase it. Um, there are some florals mixed in between, but this is 50% wood grain. So, I bought two 
Oh, and I like the brick. Um, the script is awesome. Um, some of these we could use a story base or like this one I could even cut in half and just use this as half a page. Um, I don't use bikes that much either. So cactuses, bikes, and what's the other thing? Pineapples. Those are not my <laughs> my cup of tea. But um, yeah, so I bought two of these. I don't know how much those were. $6.99. So they're the same price as the other ones. Um, and this is Project Life. When I go there and they have these Project Life, the $4.99, these are great pages for um, background pages. Um, so, and just, just their geometric designs, I always pick them up and I always use them. So I highly recommend them like that. The, this one is like an off white and then this one is white because I know some people, they don't mind mixing the white and the cream. I still have a little bit of issue with that. So I like my, my white separate and my cream separate. <clears throat> but so that is my mega haul. I am back on my spending freeze. Hopefully I can go at least three months and not go crazy when I go to Tuesday morning in three months. But uh, we'll, we'll see, we'll see what happens. Um, thanks for watching. If you have any questions or wanna know any prices or any uh, product numbers, just let me know in, uh, in the comments below and I will be more than happy to answer your questions. Thank you and have a great day, bye.